All right, guys, I'm going to do a little cook here. I got a whole chicken here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to lay it out on a cookie sheet, rinse it all off good, and season it up and bake it until it's nice and crisp. What I'm going to do with it is um, I'm going to make some cauliflower mashed potatoes. So basically I'm just going to take this cauliflower and I'm going to steam it up really good. I'm going to throw one onion in there, cut it up small, and steam it in with the cauliflower mashed potatoes. Just add butter and garlic powder to this, but I'm going to add the onion. Um, supposedly it's supposed to be really good. And I got some Brussels sprouts. I'm just going to steam these Brussels sprouts up. So that's what it's going to be. It's going to be it's a whole chicken that's all cut up. I'm just going to lay it out on the sheet, and we'll season it up good, and we'll bake it till it's crisp. I like to leave the skin on there. And we'll check out the cauliflower mashed potatoes, see how they come out. Alright guys, I'll bring you along as I go like I usually do. Alright guys, on this is I just took the chicken. You know, I rinsed it all off good. I got it defrosted. And I leave the skin on it. I'm just going to do is, I put it all close together so I can season it really good. I'm just going to season it with some some pepper, cracked pepper, fresh cracked pepper. And I put them all close together like this and I could really, you know, season it up. And it's just got an aluminum foil on there. I like a lot of pepper on there. And what I like to put on it is I like to put this, um, it's like a seasoning, um, herb seasoning mix. An oregano mix. Put that on there. And I'm just gonna. I'm gonna bake it. I'm gonna bake it in the oven. I got this poultry seasoning mix too. I kind of like using this stuff. I'll put a, a good coating on there. On that. We're just gonna bake it. You know, and bake it till it's nice and crispy, Mama. Oh yeah, Mama. It's gonna be next level, Mama. Steve is cooking again, Mama. Going to be next level. Oh, yeah. Steve's a real working man. I'll put some of this on there. It's kind of like a barbecue seasoning. Stevie Lab's a real working man, Mama. Going to be next level. All right, I'll put some garlic powder on there. Oh, yeah. How do you like that, guys? Put some seasoning on there and we'll bake it. Oh, yeah. Um, I put some black pepper on there. Some of this poultry seasoning mix. Some of this stuff here. I like this uh, Memphis original. Someone sent me that. Uh, one of my subscribers. I really like that garlic powder. And this herb. Herb mix. I like that also. So we'll just put it in the... Convection oven, 425, we'll put it on bake. It kicks it down with the convection oven. I want to get it nice and crispy, Mama. going to be nice. So we'll, we'll put it in there until it's nice and crispy. In the meantime, we'll, uh, we'll, get our mash, we'll get our cauliflower. We'll get our cauliflower stuff ready to rock and roll here. Our real working man cook series, Mama. Oh, yeah. A real working men cook. A real working men cook series. Mm, guys, I got a little bit of butter here, and I'm gonna melt the butter down and we'll throw the onions in there. So I'm kind of adding this to my recipe. You know me. I always, I always kick it up a notch. So uh, I'm gonna put a little butter in there, and we're gonna melt some more butter down after. But we'll render these. We'll render these onions down a little bit. I'm going to kick it up a notch, Mama. That's how I do it. That's how I fly. I take a recipe and then I kick it up. That's how I do it. It's how real work a man cook. So I'm making a double batch of the uh, cauliflower, mashed potato cauliflower. So it calls for one one stick of butter for a cauliflower head. So I got a couple of sticks of butter. I'll, I'll throw in there after I get this rendered down. We'll kind of melt it in this pan here. 
we'll get this rocking and rolling. I'll, uh, I'm gonna steam up the cauliflower later, and we'll crush it up. They say to put it in a blender, but I'm just gonna use my my potato masher. I'm gonna steam it up good in that pan over there. I'm gonna steam all the cauliflower up in this pan over here later. You see, I got a, a thing on the bottom. I could add some water to the bottom of that. But I'll lay the cauliflower in there and I'll steam it. See, that thing fits in there perfect. Can you see that? Can you see that thing fits in there perfect? So what I'll do is I'll, I'll put some water in the bottom there and we'll put the cauliflower in there. I got the cauliflower all cut up here. All into small pieces. And we'll just steam it. And then what I'll do is I'll just, I'll just mash it like it was mashed potatoes. I do these videos for the working men out in the field. How real working men cook. Teach working guys how to cook. It's not hard. I kind of learn as I go. I try different things and I enjoy it. You know? A lot of guys like the cooking videos. So if you don't like the cooking videos, watch my other videos. So, no big deal. That's one stick of butter. And some some garlic in there. Go to kick it up, mama. Got to be Nick Lowe. I think outside the box, man. Oh yeah. So that's basically one, you know, medium-sized onion. I kind of rendered that down and. Kind of killing two birds with one stone. I'm kind of, kind of rendering down, you know, the onion, the garlic, and uh, the butter at the same time. So, we're gonna, we're gonna try one stick of butter. If I need more butter, we'll melt some more butter after. But that's good right there. This, I got my my pan with that. It's just a little stand that holds the stuff up. Basically, is all it does. Alright guys, I got two heads of cauliflower that I cut up. I'm just going to steam it in here. Just going to steam it and then I'll mash it just like regular mashed potatoes and we're going to try it out. Now this is the first time I've done this so bear with me and uh, we'll learn together type of thing. You know? Oh yeah, mama. Alright guys, I got my... Brussels sprouts here all ready to rock and roll later when the chicken's done. I gotta cook this later, but I'm gonna wait for the chicken to come up to speed. Once the chicken gets close, we'll we'll start doing the rest of this stuff and I'll bring you guys along obviously. Alright guys, I'm gonna turn the bake down to uh 350. So when you do the convention of it, it actually drops it down another a little bit because she's coming along well, but I don't wanna I don't want to cook it too fast. I got a lot of chooch, Mom. I got a lot of chooch. All right, guys. I got the cauliflower in here. Like I said, I'm doing two heads, so I'm gonna do it. Try it two heads instead of one. So. Doing a double batch here. In the meantime, I'm still cooking the chicken. But what I did was. I got two things of butter in here and plus the onions, so that's going to go inside when I mash all the um, the cauliflower up. Onions, garlic, and two things of butter. Yum! Alright, we'll let this chooch. I'm going to bring this up to a boil. We'll get this all steamed up, and then we'll mash it. In the meantime, I got the chicken cooking. Oh, yeah. She's starting to look good in there. Oh, yeah. I like to get the stuff with the skin on it because it stays moist, you know? Where's the star of the show, baby the dog, man? Here she is, the star of the show. Baby the dog. Are you my girl, huh? Are you the star? Are you the star of the show, baby? Oh, yeah, everybody loves baby the dog. She's a cutie pie. She's a cutie pie. Cooking with gas, that's the way to go, man. Alright guys, this stuff is, she's all chewed, she's ready to rock and roll, mama. See how soft it is? We're going to shut it off, it's all steamed. I'm just going to let it sit there. 
and then after we'll mash it. Oh yeah, the chicken's coming right along there. Want to let it get it nice and crispy. Oh yeah, we want it crispy, Mama. Oh yeah. She's chuching, Mama. She's chuching. Alright guys, we're going to get the uh, Brussels sprouts rocking and rolling in the back there. See it? Set up there. Get that rocking and roll. Get that steam in there. I like Brussels sprouts. I haven't had them in a while, man. I, I really miss them, so I'm going to try that. It's going to be pretty good. We're going to have all this, you know, this cauliflower mash with the Brussels sprouts and that nice chicken. Nice crispy chicken. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Going to be yummy. She's chooching, Mama! She's chooching away there, see it? That's why I like these pans. Salad master. Good pans. Alright guys, I'm gonna mix everything in this pan here. I got my potato masher. They say to do it inside a, a, a food processor, but I don't know. I'm going to try it this way. You know me, I'm different. I got my little scoop. I'll scoop this stuff into here like this, guys. Just going to scoop this stuff right in there and we'll just mash it, you know? We're going to see what it comes out like. I recommend Cook Series. Not all of us live down in Mama's basement, you know. Some of us guys are real working men. Alright, so I got all my stuff right there, guys. And I got my onions. Two sticks of butter and garlic. Oh, yeah, look at that. Where's baby the dog? Where's baby the dog? What do you want her? She must be over here sniffing, I'm thinking. Oh, yeah. Who it is? It's the sniffer. It's baby the dog. She's the star of the show. There she is. There she is. All right, guys. So they say they say use a food processor, but guess what? I think I could use just a regular potato masher, but I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong, but we'll try it. Stevie Ladder wrong again? I don't know. I don't know, Mama. Stevie Ladder's cooking again, Mama. Stevie's cooking again. I don't know. Cauliflower mashed potatoes, Mama. Next level. Kicked up a notch. Oh, yeah. Can you guys see that? Man, that's looking some good. I'm gonna add some pepper though. Gotta add some pepper to it. And they say in the recipe add garlic powder, but I got real garlic in there. We'll put some garlic powder in there. Why not? Oh yeah. Well, let's try a little bit. Let's see what this is. Let's see. Yum. Definitely good. Do it taste does it taste like mashed potatoes? No, it tastes a little bit different, but man, it's definitely good. Oh yeah. Yum. What is this? Stop the show looking for some. For some droppings there, Mama. Oh, yeah. All right, guys, it come out good, but if it was me, the next time I would just use one stick, half a stick of butter per uh, per head, not, not two sticks. I think it's got a little bit too much butter taste to it. But other than that, it's not bad. You know, definitely yummy. 
think we're good back there with those. Oh yeah, we're done. We're done back there with those two. Yum. Yum! Oh yeah. I like to get them. I like to have it nice and crispy. A little bit longer. Oh yeah, she's done, Mama. crispy skin. We'll let it cool and we'll get a plate together for you guys. Oh yeah. A real working man cook series. She's done. Oh yeah. I like the cauliflower mashed potatoes. It's kind of healthy, you know, healthier choice. Like I said, I would go a little bit a little bit lighter on the bottom next time, but I'm in a double batch. That's how we learn, you know. We, we make something, and next time we make it a little bit different, but definitely gonna be yummy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let it cool. And we'll get a chooch. A nice beer. How real working men cook, mama? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, mama. Steve Labs a real working man, mama. Oh, yeah, he is. Steve is cooking again, mama. You want a plate? You want a plate, baby? I think she's a sniffer. She's on sniffing action. Oh, yeah, she's on sniffing action. Look at her. Look at her. Oh yeah, a real working man cook, mama. Next level. All right, guys, I let it cool for a little bit. Chicken's nice and crispy. Oh yeah. Let me try some of this first. Cauliflower mashed potatoes. We'll see what it tastes like. Very good. Healthy choice, you know, maybe a little bit less butter. Brussels sprouts, I like these. Yum. Very good. Mmm. Chicken's very good. Moist. Got the skin on it. Hear the crunch? Yum. How real working man cook series. <laughs> He's talking to me, Mama. <laughs> talking to me, Mama. <laughs> hey, Mama. <laughs> hey, Chicken Little. Is that you, Chicken Little? Chicken Little, is that you? Ha, 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 ha.